Hi, now, we will discuss the structural repair of wind turbine blades. When a blade is damaged, including damaged fibers, the scarf repair technology is applied. The damaged region is removed, the surface is grinded and prepared, and the patch is attached to the damaged laminate. Often, such works are carried out on site, even offshore, under challenging conditions and time pressure. The blade repair is expensive, and its quality is important. A technician should have detailed knowledge, how the parameters of his work influence the post-repair reliability of the blade. Defects in the adhesive, or in the scarf, can have negative effect on the blade reliability. We developed a 3D computational model of repaired laminate, which allows quick evaluation of the influence of various parameters on the stress distribution. The model is generated in Abacus code, using Python command language. The model includes the laminate, adhesive layer, composite scarf and coating. Here, you can see the stress distribution in the adhesive layer between the scarf and damaged laminate. The higher is the scarf angle, the higher the stress concentration in the laminate, and the shorter the post-repair lifetime. Also, softer adhesives create additional stresses in the laminate. A critical factor for the repair quality is the availability of voids in the adhesive layer. We modeled the voids, using the submodeling technique. It was observed that voids create local stress concentration in the adhesives, up to two times higher than in the material around. If there are voids in the highly stresses region, this will shorten the post-repair lifetime. Let us summarize the conclusions. 3D computational model of repaired wind turbine blade laminates is developed. Higher scarf angle leads to the higher stress concentration both in adhesive and in composites, and therefore to shorter post-repair lifetime. Voids located in the area on high expected stress concentration will lead to even higher stresses, and reduced post-repair lifetime of the blades. If you need a more detailed report, please contact us per email.